Okay. Okay. Whoa. Oh, ho, ho, ho. That is some athleticism. going everyone YouTube with Corey here aka Crasher back with a new video and ladies and gentlemen welcome to a more light-hearted video in today's video we are going to be checking out what happens when you eat a bee from daily dose of internet and I can tell already that yeah it's going to not be very fun for that individual so with that being said show the original some love let's have some fun guys let's go okay let's do this Hello, All right. Everyone, this is your Hello everyone, this is your daily dose of internet. I a burger and ate a All right. Oh. I cooked the hamburger. What the and hell? I was eating it and I almost lost my first one. I felt this pain in my tongue. Oh my so, god, that thing is vacuum. huge. When I opened my mouth and there was a bee on it and it stung my, my tongue. Oh my god! Oh my god, the swelling down. So somebody please help me. He later got some treatment and the Holy swelling Holy shit! So a bee was on. Was... Wow! Okay. <laughs> That's so cute, the little kitty! This guy went to a bar and ordered glasses oh. of water for women that he liked. Okay. The gentleman over there got this for you. A water? Okay. I'm a little intrigued. Okay. Well, I mean, water's a good thing to drink, you know, like, especially when you're dehydrated. And, you know, if it's if it's on a, uh, you know, a night out, you definitely, definitely got to drink some water as well. You know what I mean? Okay. Let's see this. a regular commuter train was coming by at the same time and blocked their view. Oh. Oh, oh no! <laughs> oh! That sucks. I hate when that happens when when your view gets blocked and stuff. This guy can jump really, really high. Oh. Okay. Okay. Whoa! Oh! That is some athleticism. Nice. It's almost as if he's like wearing moon boots, but he's not. It's that's all that's all legit. Oh. Oh! I love that shot right there, especially with the sunset as well. God damn. Oh ho oh, ho! Oh. This family was a nice. buried alive when they died, so they made a grave with handles on the inside that opened to the outside. When what? they died, they were also buried with some food and water. They also made an air vent at the top so uh, they could breathe if they ever woke up. What the hell? Here's an okay. incredible drone shot of Italy's countryside. Oh! <laughs> what a view right there! Nice! Wow! <laughs> I do love me drone footage, especially... This that looks found nice. Out that a goldfish cracker fits perfectly in her ear. Oh. Okay. Let's <laughs> let's see this. It kind it yeah it, it kind of does actually. Oh, that's so cute. Okay. Where is this at? I wonder. Either way. That's the end of this video. Looks Hopefully I'm looks your day just amazing. A and I'll see you guys again very, very soon. Okay. Later. Well, that's it. That's the that's the video. <laughs> Some pretty interesting stuff took place there. Wow. All right. Time for my thoughts. And first things first. Going into this, I thought that the person that ate the bee done it as like some sort of like stupid stunt or something like that. No, it was done completely on accident. He was minding his own business, you know, chowing down on a burger and a bee ends up stinging his tongue. And I didn't think that your tongue could swell like that from a bee sting. I mean, I've never seen something like that before, so it's definitely, definitely new to me. Holy shit. I also feel really bad for the Harry Potter fans that waited for a war knows how long in that video to watch the Harry Potter train go by, only for a mundane regular train passing by and blocking their view. 
That absolutely sucked. Damn, man. Sorry about your luck. Now, one of the biggest things about this video is involving this man right here. The athleticism this dude has is amazing. Like, holy shit. I have not seen anyone jump quite like that. At least, you know, not in a long ass time. Like, that dude is like super athletic. God damn. He's got the genetics and... I am jealous. I, even on my best day, could not jump that high. And I have to say as well, like, you don't see that type of thing too often. So this dude is incredibly gifted. Very, very impressive. And speaking of impressive, I have to talk about this as well. The skier doing those amazing jumps while the sun setting in the background made a very nice visual in this video. You had a skilled skier going ham and having fun on the track, and the sight, the background, man, was just absolutely breathtaking. It was a sight to behold, man. That was a very, very nice clip. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, those are just some of my thoughts right there in regards to this video. What clip stuck out to you guys the most? Whatever it happens to be, ladies and gents, I'd love to hear your guys' thoughts and opinions in the comments down below. Thank you very much for watching. You guys are damn awesome. Have a good one, and I'll see you guys in the next video.